Hey everybody, it's Jesse with Nexus 5 Softmodder. Today I'm going to show you how to have the Facebook Messenger style chat head feature for your SMS messages. A while ago, Facebook Messenger came up with a new feature called chat heads, which allowed the user to have notifications from other people that appeared as bubbles that you can move around on almost any app and you can tap the bubble to respond to the message, you can move the bubble away completely. And we were waiting for that feature to be incorporated into other applications because it's a pretty great feature. One of the things you can do now is use Ninja SMS Free to emulate that feature for your text messages. So go ahead and go to the Play Store, download it, open it up. What you do, you'll see that Ninja SMS looks like pretty much any third-party SMS Android app. It does the job, you get text messages, you respond to them, everything looks pretty normal. But one thing that it does that the other apps don't do is it gives you that chat head feature, which is pretty great. So you really only have two tabs to worry about. You have all your messages on the tab to the left. The tab to the right shows you all of your contacts and you can scroll through and uh, by default everyone is checked so everyone will get a chat head so you don't have to worry about that. Um, there are some settings you can tweak which gives you more flexibility than apps you're probably used to. You can choose themes between white and black. You can um, adjust the, the, um, the pop up settings themselves, the size of the head, um, the shapes, but some of this stuff costs money. If you want to use hearts, for example, you got to pay some money, but you can just leave with the, with the default settings and I think you'll be pretty happy with it. So there's not a whole lot to set up here. The only thing you have to worry about is whether or not you want to set the application as the default, which you can do here, um, down for default messaging app. If you don't set it as default, you'll still get the chat heads, you won't have to worry about it, but you might get duplicate um, SMS notifications. So if you're using something like Hangouts, you'll get the chat head and you also get something in your drop down notifications from Hangouts as well. So if you don't want to have two, then just go ahead and set it as your default um, SMS app. You won't have to worry about it. Once you do, everything should work as planned. I'll just send a little text, test text message to myself to show you what it looks like. So let's say you're on Wikipedia and you're reading through, you'll get the op you'll get the notification in your drop down menu, of course, but then you'll get the little bubble right here. And this is what it looks like in Facebook Messenger. You can move the bubble around, you can tap on it to open the message. In this case, I just wrote test to myself, pretty easy. Um, you can collapse the bubble by tapping this arrow, or you can expand it by hitting that. There you go. Okay. So it's pretty basic stuff, but it's also pretty great, and I highly recommend it if you want to give yourself an opportunity to try out a new messenger that has a really great and cool feature. And that's everything. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And for the full tutorial, check out Nexus 5 Softmodder. Thanks a lot.